as well think. Do you believe what it is that you're asking for? I want to say something from memory of a paraphrasing. It's not going to be word for word, but it just hit my spirit. Jesus was walking down uh, uh, a street and it was someone who said, Jesus, Jesus, heal me. Will you heal me? Jesus looked at the person and said, do you believe that I can do what you just asked me to do? The person looked up at Jesus and said, yes. Jesus said, get up and go home. You're healed. Your faith has healed you. See, you have to believe. A lot of people throw up empty prayers. They don't even believe in God. They're just saying it to probably impress someone. Or maybe they're not there yet in faith. But let me help you to get there in faith. You have to believe and trust in God. You believe and trust in everything else and everybody else in life. You believe what mom and dad told you. And I'm not saying anything against mom and dad. I'm not saying anything against mom and dad, okay? But you believe in big brother and big sister. You believe in your school teacher, your counselor. You believe in everyone you came across with in, in, in life. You believe your job. You believe the federal, state, and city governments. Oh, but when it comes to God, ah, waste of time. Oh, really? Brothers and sisters, my prayer is that everyone who do not believe, who is weak in your faith, that you change. You change and realize the truth. And what is the truth? God is real. And God loves you. 